Okay, uh, it's 401, Wednesday, March 1st, 2023, and we're going to start the uh, Town of Sangerville Select Board meeting. We'll begin with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Item 2, approval of the minutes, select board meeting 2-15-2023, and B, select board meet, special meeting 2-27-2023. Um, I can only... Um, you can second A. Oh, A. Yeah, 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 switch, switch. You do. And <laughs> I make I'll, your folks to approve A and B is red. Okay, and I abstain from B since I'm not... And I second A. And we'll vote on A. All in favor, or all three in favor. We'll vote on B. Two of us are in favor. Um, item review, treasurer's warrants, payroll 16 and 18, accounts payable 17 and 19. I make a motion to approve A and B as red. Second. All in favor? We're all three in favor. That was just, that's going to that's that's, that's, so I know, it could screw up. up and <laughs> <we're> just, <laughs> <laughs> OCD. You want to yeah. do it again? <laughs> no. Nope. Uh, through once, that's enough. Open session, we do have a guest. Uh, would you like to speak? Yep. Uh, please introduce yourself and Dennis, have at it. Dennis Campbell on South Sangville Grange Road. Okay. Um, I mentioned last summer to Laura, last, uh, Lorna, last fall that uh, we had problems up in the cemetery. There were three or four big maple trees over there that have come down over the years with one left. The center of it is dead and woodpeckers are working on it. It needs to come down. Uh, I'm offering to take it down and clean up the mess if you want me to. If if you don't want me to do it, then please get someone else to do it. It needs to come out of here. Uh, there's other problems. We've got stones falling over and broken. Um, if you have somebody that's supposed to fix those, that needs to be done. If not, then I'll, I'll at least work on some of them, but I can't do them all. Um. Okay, we reached a bu budget on the stones last year for repair, but that's the first uh, cemetery this year that the Sexton can uh, take care of. So we have... In the so it's at the front of the line? Yeah, for the repair of the stones. What about the tree? Uh, is the tree uh, uh, adjacent to the cemetery? It's in the middle of the cemetery. Okay, yeah, well, I'm sure we'll address that as well. Mm -hmm. I'll have to get... Um, oh, we had a similar problem... Uh, on the, on the French's Mill Cemetery, I had a big old pasture pine that yeah. just collapsed right in the middle of something. Yeah. 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 I, I'm offering to take it down and clean it up if you want, but if, if not... Do you have a bucket or something, Dennis, that you can... I mean, if it's in the middle, I'm just envisioning in the middle with no place for it to go. No, there's room enough to fall it. I, I can, I can hook, put a cable on it and pull it over on the back side. I don't, I don't think we should ask him to do that. I'm not going to ask anybody to do it, but if he wants to do it and he wants to sign a... I say a, a waiver. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, don't, I mean, I don't want to do it. I got no. I mean, well, then, we'll, we'll have it down. Do it. It's no big deal. You shouldn't do it. No, I'm, I'm, but I'm glad to do it. If if if, if the town can't get it done, then I'm willing. No, to No, we can get Ingstrom's up there. Ingstrom's. Yeah, yeah. Ingstrom's. Yeah. Yeah. That's, That's who we use on them. all the other yeah. trees. Ingstrom's can go in and do it. Yeah, because they can get. I'm just saying, if you did anything like that, it's no different than anybody else. If somebody wants to volunteer. As long as they're willing to have a waiver, then that's okay too. But we, it's our responsibility. The town needs to. I'll sign a waiver, but whatever. Uh, as long as you get it down. Yeah. We can get it. Down. And yeah. still having major issues with the road. Um, I, I could tell you that road is up for discussion, along with a couple others, as to what its status is going to be going forward. Yeah. Uh, so it, it may be actually a situation where. I mean, right now you can't work on the road because its status is a town way. If that's not the case, anybody who wants to work on that road can work on it. Well, so. no, nobody graded that road last spring, so I did. Well, I remember the last time you were in, I think you told us nobody had been, done anything there since the 70s. 75 is the last time it had gravel. So that's that's really all we need to know. Mm -hmm. main, main DOT says a gravel road loses up to an inch of gravel a year but due to plowing and erosion and dust and traffic. You know, my wife left the car down at Wilson's for five weeks last spring, and, and two weeks ago we had to leave it down there again. We're also looking at uh, the status of the Eastler Road, too. It's kind of 
I don't mean both of those are right there, but the, both of those roads, we need to we need to work on those. Yep. So that's after town meeting, I would say. Work on their status. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. These other folks are here for budget meeting. So yeah. That's okay. <laughs> you, but you're welcome to stay. Stay. You can leave whatever you're doing. You're free to go. But you don't have to wait for that. I guess probably enough of my own budget that they do it. Thanks, Dennis. Um, item five: Old Business Town Hall Building. Anything new there? No. Um, we had mentioned. Just that made me think of it. Have you run into Cameron at all? No. Okay. No. I just, I know we're, we're not going to do anything in the next few weeks, but it would be good to know if, if he's maybe we, open to that. Will we visit that? Yes. Yeah. Oh, we, yes. I'd like to, I just, right. to know what's available. Yeah. yeah just Cause we don't have a lot of supply. No, no we don't. No. Um, and that layout in there off of that side that they showed us oh, last year, would be that would, would be work perfect. so much better. It's yeah. nice. In there. Yeah. yeah. Uh, updated drawings. I saw them. Did you guys see them? The one from yesterday. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I think we're hitting the mark now. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah. finally. Yep. Um, no, so, okay. Um, new business? None. Uh, town manager report. 30 day lien notice for 2022 taxes to be mailed on 3 3 22. Yes. 114 of them. As of today, it could change by Friday, but they're ready to go. How many did you have last year? Actually, we had a little bit more. Actually. Okay, oh. so it's a typical year. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. And then they all get cleaned up. However, the tax and the interest is going up. Oh, yeah. Yes, yeah. that's true, too. <laughs> <laughs> uh, road Commissioner's report. No. Uh, select Woods Concerns. Well, I don't have, uh, I just had a couple of things. One, I sent you the letter, um, and Lorna did receive this letter. And I did read it. Okay. I don't know if Dale did or not. I From the hospital. Did you read it? I did. But. Okay, okay. All right. Yeah. So, um, and the, the it didn't really answer any questions that or anything. No, no. Concerned. And this 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 letter was not generated in, as a result of my meeting with. Okay. with this was generated prior to the yeah, it was on February thirteenth. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And um, it was coincidence. Every single letter was mailed out to all the towns that they serve, and yep. they basically oh. were stating. But I do think of significance is they are willing to teach or, or train any of uh, anyone. Um, for free, um, in as either EMT and paramedic training. Yeah, my guess is they've reached out to all the local vocational schools and high schools. And they all know this. I no, they actually do it. They usually have a program internally. No, but even, so they're aware that it exists. I mean, no, that's what I'm they, saying. Is they do their own program, so they yeah. reach out to other people. Anybody that wants to get that training, they usually perform it somewhere in Maine. Like I took the EMT course in Greenville, and I okay. right, okay, right. And but it's, free, just, it's anybody in the public that wants to get involved, with right? It. And, yeah. My right. guess is a lot of people don't know that you can get it for free, right? Exactly. And so, so anyway, it would that be incumbent upon them to communicate yeah, that. Right. Yeah. And then I only have one other thing, um, and um, there is a gentleman who lives in this town who um, is actually a certified paving inspector that I just found out. And um, so, you know, this may be something I talked to him. Um, he works for Kleinfelters, which I, I didn't look it up. I have not yet looked it up. Um, but he's DOT certified to do paving inspection, and that's what he does all day long. Um, nice resource. Good so, big. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I said, yeah. I mentioned to him, I said, would that be something? He's like, yeah, yeah. You know, that's he, cool. he does it all day We've long. We've got a few that he could look at. Right, right. <laughs> so... Um, Anyway, I'll keep that. Actually, I'll just give that name. Yeah, he's on the fire department. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, so. Okay. Anything? I'm drawing a blank. Um, okay. Motion to adjourn. Second. In favor. It's four eleven, and we vote to adjourn. Yes, all three. We are adjourned. Okay.